Uh, I'm Irving Kahn. I'm uh, 106 years of age, but I'm very glad to participate with younger people who started just the way they are now starting now in this very unusual expansion of the science of economics. For well, that's I'm known by the profession as being a value investor and the first uh, uh, to follow Benjamin Graham uh, when he began the course as a graduate in uh, uh, Columbia University, published his book, Security Analysis. This interview can be summarized as a congratulation to the students of Cambridge University who took the course originally created in New York by Benjamin Graham, who lived until 1974. And all people who have taken his books or his suggestions have complete confidence that they did the right thing and that they should look to continue doing it, no matter what country they're in or what profession they have if the principles are still carefully preserved and practiced. Uh, in the 1930s, approximately, and uh, found that he too had gone to Columbia, in his case as a graduate, as a scholarship student. And uh, it was through that estimate that uh, when I took the course that year when it first began, I realized how valuable it would be to use study and research instead of making estimates based upon opinions of people who often knew less than I did about the same subject. Today, if you look at the successful people in the, in the Wall Street field, you'll find that a very high percentage of people that went through the same course that I'm describing, I had made in the earlier year. I would say that I tried to learn because I saw that Graham was both a scholarship man from Columbia University but also uh, treated the subject as a daily subject which you could confirm or deny because you just saw it happen and the market said you're wrong and you're right. Graham was always talking about facts, most of which could be corrected or, or accepted and therefore had a very good record of success in the final judgment he made about the end of undervalued uh, security. He was a remarkable man in many ways, very talented, and he knew several languages well. Professionally, his father was an immigrant from England and uh, was in the pottery business. Uh, hardware business, and uh, unfortunately he died early and left a widow with three children, of which Ben Graham was one. And uh, as a result, Graham went to, had to, went to work at a relatively early age, but it very quickly learned how, how, much, how many opportunities there were. And uh, after a short term, decided to write articles writing correctly about mistakes that were being made by the general public in the investing, which led to the writing of the book, Security Analysis. It's still very fundamentally true that you cannot call something that you bought and sold within a short period of a few weeks, a few months, or even a few years, and call it an investment. It generally takes 
between three and perhaps seven years to mature that your judgment was right and you made a good gain or that you didn't make a gain at all and you made a bad judgment, but you d can't rely upon uh, the result as if it could be accomplished in a short period. It usually takes a period of several years to corroborate uh, your judgment. The Times today confuses most people because there are good arguments for the uh, depression coming to an end and there were poor answers. And I think it's quite early to say which one is the one you should follow. And we'll probably be closer to knowing the answer after the date of the presidential election.